Good evening, guys. Hope everybody's having a wonderful Saturday evening. I'm just out here in my cock house doing a little cleaning up, kind of a kind of a pre-clean, you know, getting everything ready so I can clean it again later, of course, a couple more times. Always happens at the beginning of every year. Anyway, been on a lot of sites today, been looking at a lot of groups, a lot of people, listening to the comments. Been listening to dog people, horse people, cow people, show cow people, show dog people, show horse people, working dog people, working horse people, all kinds of people that have animals, and I love them. All of them in a panic. People talking about moving. Where's the best state to move to now? What's what would be the best place to go? Where's it safe? Brought back flashbacks to the early two thousands when Oklahoma became illegal and everybody went to move to Mexico, New Mexico, move to New Mexico. Well, Richardson signed a little letter, put it in there. Move to New Mexico, it'll always be legal here. Put it in the game cop. Well, I'm here to tell you people that don't work. That don't work, and the only people that's making a leaps and bounds from this, I read this law. The only people that is making good things about this law is uh, the people that's got y'all panicking on both sides. They are groups is up their membership because they put another feather in their cap. All these groups that you're members of, that you pay to go into, you pay for this, you pay for that, you donate for this, you donate for that. All their memberships are up too, so they're the ones that one side needs the other. 20 years ago, I watched a documentary about two hate groups. You know, racial hate groups. They were supposed to have a big demonstration where they were going to clash in a town. Had a secret camera slipped in one of the offices. There was the leader of the one hate group sitting with the leader of the other hate group, just uh, discussing their details. They were friends. But, but meanwhile, the whole time, both of them is ching, 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 their membership's up. One side needs the other. That's the reason all of you animal lovers, including myself, until we start seeing the smoke and mirrors cut through the bullshit, go straight to the source. This is going to continue. You don't have to worry about it. Because the worst thing animal rights activist group wants is for you to quit raising animals. Puts them out of a job. They ain't got no reason to want more members. Worst thing that happened to all these little groups is for AR groups to leave us completely alone. Puts them out of a job. They have nothing to scare you with. Think about it. Use what's right here. All smoke and mirrors. Every bit of it. One day, we'll all get together. All the people that truly love the animals, we'll all get together. We'll go to Washington. And we'll get our rights back. But until then, let's just keep playing smoke and mirrors. Y'all have a great day, guys. God bless you.